Hey, just wanted to take a quick video to um, give you a better understanding of what's going on up here on this roof. So this is a three tab code minimum shingle on this roof and is no doubt at the end of its useful life. Um, let's start with the shingles here. <clears throat> so you can see that the granules, the granule depletion is so significant that you can literally see right through the asphalt mat to the fiberglass. So essentially a asphalt shingle like this is made up of three main components. You have an asphalt and fiberglass mat that is protected from the sun and UV rays by these granules. So these granules are the sunscreen. And when you start losing these granules, the um, asphalt starts to emulsify and literally deteriorates down to nothing. And what people don't understand about these shingle roofs is that these shingles are designed to shed water. They're not waterproof by any stretch of imagination. Um, so the steeper a roof is, a better a shingle will perform. And this is a pretty low slope. It's not a very steep slope roof. So, you know, water does have a hard time getting off of this roof. But on something like this in a heavy duty driving rain for any amount of time, water is absolutely penetrating right down through this. I mean, this is paper thin. I can't even get my fingernail under it, it's so thin. So I would absolutely recommend uh, a replacement as opposed to a repair. Um, right here you can see that you're beginning to lose adhesion on the shingles. So they're just able to lift right up. And they've been doing that for a while to the point that the nails underneath are starting to rust. Um, and my fear here is that wind can get underneath these see this one's still a little bit adhered about halfway this other side still adhered but wind can get underneath these when they get so brittle and lose adhesion and can literally snap them right off and that's when you start seeing um, broken tabs on the roof other thing i wanted to point out here's another illustration of how worn these are right here you can see those fibers real good um, and you don't you want to be able to see that because it's not even water resistant at that point and i'm worried about your plywood decking underneath now and then here's your plumbing boot it's absolutely deteriorated it's wide open you can literally see right down into the attic down there um, so that's taking on water right now there's no doubt this one's doing the same exact thing here you can see that it's deteriorated as well um, so just some things to uh, think about and then as soon as I got up I just wanted to point this out you've got deck nails which are starting to back out right here see that's a deck nail right there it's backing out and then there's another one here starting to back out and then right here as well so yeah this roof is it needs to be replaced that's all there is to it um, and it's very straightforward it's a big roof there's no doubt there's a lot of area but I would absolutely recommend a full replacement over trying to do repairs. All right, hope this video is helpful. Thank you so much for the opportunity.